Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a question that many, that many TypeScript developers encounter. How to convert a string to a Boolean. Our viewer is looking for a more elegant solution than the basic comparison method. They mention a common approach where a string is checked against true, but they want to know if there's a way to validate the input without extra steps, similar to .NET's bool.tryparse. Let's dive into this intriguing challenge and explore the options available in TypeScript. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you find that resolution you need. Anyway, let's continue on. To convert a string to a Boolean in TypeScript, we can start with a simple comparison. For example, if we have a string input that we want to convert, we can check if it equals true. However, this method requires us to validate the input first. If the input is not true, it will not convert correctly. We need a more elegant solution that handles invalid inputs gracefully. In .NET, we have a method called bool.tryparse that attempts to convert a string to a Boolean and returns false if the conversion fails. Unfortunately, TypeScript does not have a built-in equivalent. To achieve similar functionality in TypeScript, we can create our own utility function. This function will attempt to parse the string and return a Boolean value or null for invalid inputs. Now we can use this function to safely convert strings to Booleans without worrying about invalid inputs. Let's see how it works in practice. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To convert a string to a Boolean in TypeScript, the function returns true for values like 1, 1, true, and true, regardless of case. For all other values, it returns false. Here's how the function works. It checks if the value is a string, converts it to lowercase, and checks if it equals true or parses it as a number. If it's not a string, it simply returns the Boolean value. Unit tests confirm the function's behavior. It checks various cases, ensuring that the function returns true or false as expected for different inputs. For more details, you can check the original post linked in the description. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To convert a string to a Boolean in TypeScript, you can use an array of valid values. This array includes true, 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 one, and one. Alternatively, you can implement a switch statement for more complex logic, as shown in a related Stack Overflow answer. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To 
convert a string to a Boolean in TypeScript, you can create a function called toBoolean. This is useful when dealing with environment variables, for example, using process.env in Node. You can find a live example of this function in the provided code sandbox link. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To convert a string to a Boolean in TypeScript, you can use a simple function. This function takes a value that can be a string, number, boolean, or null. Here's the code for the function. It first converts the input to a string and then checks if it equals true or one. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To convert a string to a Boolean in TypeScript, you want your variable to be true for both true and the string true. Similarly, it should be false for false and the string false. Here's a simple function to achieve this. It checks if the input is a Boolean or a string, returning the appropriate Boolean value. This function ensures that any unexpected input defaults to false, making it robust for various types. And that's it guys. I hope we found the solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.